I got a question here from Mike asking about how to create jar files with IntelliJ 13. If you don't know what a jar file is, that's a way to package up your Java program so that you can send it to other people or put it on other computers and they can run it without needing your source code or needing to install IntelliJ or anything like that. Things are a bit different with IntelliJ 13 compared to I think IntelliJ 11 was what I was using when I recorded a lot of those videos. So let me show you how to do this. So here I've got a game I've been working on. I can run it from IntelliJ and you can see it works. So let's make this package up into a jar file. I'm going to go to the project structure window, which is here in the file menu. You can also press command semicolon. We go to artifacts, click this plus button and under jar, we will make a jar file from existing modules. So we have, in my case, it's my Pong game. This should be the name of your program. And you need to find the main class, click this browse button. And you probably will only have one. If you have multiple main methods in your project, you might see different ones. So choose the one that you want to run when someone tries to open up the jar file. And everything else should be fine as it is. And that's it. Let's hit OK. And then we go to Build and say Build Artifacts. And it pops up this little menu. It's the Pong jar file in my case. This will be the name of your project. And hit Build. And it should be done. Um, I don't see any errors on this bottom bar. So I'm going to quit IntelliJ now and go into Finder. And in the folder where I have my project, uh, there's this folder called Out. And if I open it up, there's a new one in here called Artifacts now, and then the name, and here's the jar file. So this is the file that you want to send to people. And I'm just going to copy it to my desktop. If I double click it, it's going to start up my game. And that's all there is to it. Hope that helps out.